Well, good morning, everybody. It's about 3.15 a.m. Yep, that early. My usual wake-up time for work, because I'm crazy like that. But today, we're headed off for an adventure. We're Sierra bound. I'm gonna go pick up Suk Young, mountain rescue buddy. We're gonna meet up with a few others that are already up there on the east side. And hopefully, we're gonna try to get into Mount Darwin and Mendel today. Well, not today, this weekend. We're gonna hike in today, partway acclimatize and then spend the next few days attempting to get out there and summit. There's a ton of snow, it's going to be a ski trip, and it's uh, mountain rescue training as well, and I'm really looking forward to it. Made it to the park and ride, picking up Suk Young. Let's do it. Yeah. Good morning. I live inside my own world of make believe. Kids screaming in the cradles, profanities. I see the world through ice covered in pink and bleach. Cross out the ones who hit my cars and watch me weep. I love everything. Fire spreading all around my room My world's so bright It's hard to breathe But that's alright Well we are loaded up The pack is ready to go We're going to be hiking up the road here Because it's closed at Aspendale Aspendale And uh, we just weighed packs I'm at about 50 pounds Zach what are you at? 57 57 Alicia? 47 now for 40, 47 for 47. Alicia Nick? 56. Nick won't even tell me, but it begins with a six. Oh boy. <laughs> Bring all the gears to the mountains. Is... Yes. All the gears. Oh, right. Woo. I'm tired. <laughs> Well, a mile in, we made it to the North Lake turnoff. Creeks are raging. Still clear of snow. Cars down there. go going up oh we just heard our first bit of thunder for the day from that cloud over there I don't think it's coming right this way but there's clouds all around us so I'll be surprised if we don't get a thunder shower today man that's pretty How's everybody doing? Good. Pretty good. Sweet. Sweet. Hell of a view. Just about up to Grass Lake, 10,000 feet or so. Well over three miles in. Howdy. Hello there. It is gorgeous out here. Well, we just had a little bit of lunch here. Got a few snowflakes from the thunder clouds. No more thunder yet, fortunately. And uh, we're at about 10,000 feet. We're gonna try to make it to 10, six, maybe 11, and set up camp there. That's the goal for the day, if the weather holds up for us. Well, what do you think, Nick? 
here and then head up left? Yeah, I think that's a good plan. This will be challenging skiing down this in a with a heavy pack. Oh man, probably about 10, 7, 10, 8, somewhere like that. Climbing up still. Steep section. Making some switchbacks. <sighs> So Kyung making it up the steep section turned out to be a little easier to boot pack than stay on the skis. Well, we made it to 11,000 feet. A little bit of a climb ahead of us and a flat spot down here. I think we're gonna call this camp for the night. It'll do, it's about five o'clock and we're pretty wore out. Coming up from sea level this morning doesn't help, that's for sure. Ah, oh, yeah, ready to get this pack off. You want over by the big rock that you're at? I want to taste your content, hold your breath and feel it. Attention, devils hide behind redemption. Honesty is a one way gate to have. I want to taste consumption. Big faster to waste oxygen. Hear the children sing aloud. This part of my ski binding, or my ski boot, yeah, I just noticed it's like cracked. That. That's and no bueno. Yeah, like if I lock it into ski mode. You can see it oh, like, yeah. coming you, off as soon as I back put on any that? flex on it. So I think it would just Oof. break. Yeah. So we gotta figure out what we're gonna do based on that. But I think we'll chillax here for the night. We're not going anywhere else today. And we'll sort it out in the morning, figure out what to do. With Suck Young's broken boot, yeah. we decided it wasn't wise for him to go any higher. So he's gonna stay back. Aaron and I and Nick and Alicia are going to attempt to summit Lamarck, Mount Lamarck today. Ski down, get back here by probably mid afternoon and either stay here again tonight or start working our way back down. Cause that broken boot is no bueno. But beautiful day, it's gonna be a hot one. And uh, it's what, 8.30ish, we're starting our way up. About 2,500 vert, 2,000 to the cull, and then another 500 over to the, the summit, I think. Shall we? Let's do it. All right. Nice work, Aaron. That was steep. Time to go steep. refill some water. Making progress, probably 12,000 feet or so. Still climbing. We are just about to Lamarck Call. That's the whole low spot in the ridge behind me there. And having a snack break here. Oh yeah. Now we're talking. Darwin and Mendel out there. would be a long day. Scrambling across the talus field in ski boots. Always good fun. Adds to the adventure. <laughs> Had to drop down a little, avoid the steep rock. But the snow's a little easier to travel on anyway, so this is working out pretty good. Pretty nice so far. Wow. 
Well, we're making good progress. One of those two peaks over there is the summit, not sure which, but getting close. Well, I was wrong. That's not the summit. Summit's up there somewhere. Aaron, what did you just say a minute ago? What's that? You said... You've got to be fucking kidding me. I agree with Aaron. Just like, give me some vertical callus and call it a day. It is gorgeous out here. Oh, hell yeah. I'll take that. Holy cow. <laughs> Amazing. We made it. <laughs> Mount Lamarck, 13454. Lamarck Couloir down below in the gully. And our camp is down that way. Darwin and Mendel out here. Gotta make sure I don't lose my balance because it drops a little ways over there. Isn't that crazy? So freaking cool. While Aaron enjoys the summit block up there, I'm gonna go around this side where I've got a good take off angle to the east a good flat spot to set up easily and get the wire in the air if you're running the mountaintop or mtr 2v and a 2040 hen fed half wave today so it takes about four hours from camp to get to the summit here maybe a little less yeah three 345 or so and it's uh just afternoon i think so we're doing pretty good on time, and the weather is absolutely beautiful today. I love everything. Fire spreading all around my room. My world's so bright, it's hard to breathe, but that's all. Well, because I'm special and I didn't bring my electronics kit that had my extra charging stuff and my inline audio recorder again, uh, we're gonna do a band-aid fix here. Gonna use the phone as the audio recorder. I have no speaker, so what I need to do is use a band aid to fix one of the earbuds to my phone. Let's see how this works. The microphone used by the audio recorder is this one down on the bottom here. So I need to situate that. We'll find out. Gary. <laughs> I 
And Martha. Thank you, Gary and Martha. Summit to summit. W6. IN015. Very cool. Probably ground wave there. Thank you. That's probably Mike. K6STR. <laughs> nice. Let's give 40 a try. There's Josh. 339 in Washington on 40. I'll take it. I think that'll do. Ah, uh, yeah. Whew. Well, Mount Lamarck in the bag. 13,454. <coughs> Got 11 contacts in the log, including Brooks, Aaron's better half. Far better half. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Remember who you knew first. Well, which one has a ham radio license? Oh, ouch. Ouch. Humility. Yep, that's how we get her to get her license. But it's been a fun summit, it's about one o'clock, and we're gonna start making our way down, get back to camp, and decide if we want to try to get down the hill any further. We shall see. Not a bad view, huh? That's Nick and Alicia starting their way down. Darwin and Mendel, the two big peaks. 
Darwin on the left, Mendel on the right. Oh yeah, we're booted up, skied up, and ready to rock and roll from Lamarck Call, head on down. It's gonna be a little bit of an adventure trying to maintain elevation so we don't have to put skins back on or hike too much. So we'll see how it goes, but it should be good fun. You wanna let it rip, Nick? Yeah. Get it done. Give it Enjoy. Nick's down. Little hole there. <laughs> All right, I guess it's my turn. chunky here on the sun cups but not too bad avoid the jump so far so good look at those tracks up there it's almost like we knew what we were doing I think that's our buddy. Make some turns. Nice work. Yeah, Nick. Yeah. That was pretty sweet. Yeah, it was. All right, go fill up some water here. back at camp it's three o'clock and we decided we're gonna see if we can make it out today so we're gonna pack everything up and start working our way down the hill driven by beer, driven by beer at the bottom of the hill that is a strong motivator
All right, it is time to start heading down. Got full packs. We are back on skins. We got down to Grass Lake and we got some flat to deal with. So, slogging our way down, but the beer is calling. Well, we made it across the flats and the traversing and all the hard stuff. And I think we can just ski down from here to the road and then finish our hike out. I'm really hoping that's the case. We shall see. North Lake, just right down there through the trees. We made it back to the road. Just a couple miles back down to the car. It'd be nice to wear some regular shoes for this. Get these ski boots off. It's about time. Back at the North Lake Road turn off. Quite a view up there. I know. Not bad. What face is that? Sabrina. Yeah, Lake Sabrina's up there. There's no passes up there. Okay. So it's a little bit limiting, but Mount Heckel. Uh, Wallace is up there, Mount Thompson, I think Gilbert is up there, which has an alpine ice climb that hasn't been in in years. So maybe this year? Uh, we'll see. Well, we made it back to the end of the road, back to the car. Four days and three nights turned into two days and one night, but a solid adventure nonetheless. We had a good time up there. Now we're gonna head on down the hill, get us some food and probably a beer to go with it. That sounds pretty darn good at this point. So 7-3 for now, everybody. We'll catch you on the next adventure. We made it! Woohoo! Woo! Oh Back yeah. Let's take a beer. Hey, it looks like beer is written on your face. Oh.